YouTubers, Electric Adventures here with another original Spectre Video gameplay. Um, this is the very first game that I played for the system back in the day. Um, it came bundled with it, with another game called Armored Assault. Um, it was also released for the ColecoVision. Um, I don't have that version for the ColecoVision as yet. But this was my very first look at the Spectre Video and um, I really enjoyed this game back in the day. Um, you know, I, how well a machine played Space Invaders was actually very important for determining um, you know, how much you liked the machine at the particular time when these systems came out. And this was Space Invaders with a little bit more. It's not quite Galaxian, although it does hark back to Galaxian, and it does have some other gameplay elements. We'll, we'll, do, we'll do a couple of quick levels on... Um, actually, no, I won't play it on easy, because... Uh, yeah, it, as with all these games, if you play them on easy, you actually don't get all of the gameplay elements. So I'll start on the second level. I've just done a very quick recording there to make sure that I have fixed the recording settings on this PC. And we don't get frame rate uh, madness. So we're going to try skill level 2. Yeah. And as usual, they really like driving the sound chip to full volume. I'll fix in the editing for you guys, but oh, you can help me on my headphones. So you have your your dudes up the top, and you have your mother ship that goes over the top. So the key strategy is to get a um, hole in your um, enemy formation, so you can try and get that mother ship as it comes across. They um, gradually wear down your barriers. The barriers get refreshed each level. Oh god, I missed that by oh, a minute. Oh, pixels. It really has quite full on sound. You have to be extremely fast to get that. Second stage, so you basically get a different formation, different coloured enemies. Now, I'd like to point out, I can move my ship up and down. Um, that's important shortly. Oops, didn't quite time that. Now the next level of gameplay elements we're still not quite getting. So third lot of enemy. And yes, that was close. Okay, so we're back to the first round, we get our shields refreshed. And now they try and invade your home base. Now he puts a mine down there. Got one mothership. You can't shoot your own barriers, which is. Come along, 
nicely like that, you have a chance to shoot them. A lot of the Spectrum Video games had this whoops, concept of changing gameplay, which is quite good. So adding extra elements. Right, so if you go round, it's not a score base, but I've got an extra man then, so when you clear the screen, Got. I'm over shoot. I think this is an absolute onslaught of a game. God, you really got to pick the gaps in the um, guys. We've only got the one life left, so it's... the alert level's gone up. Big explosions. So the game's either over with when they mine all behind you, so they blow up your base, and regardless of how many lives you left, or if you run out of lives, like I just did. So it had two levels of reward, um, you know, the four intrinsic uh, pattern levels, and then it loops around, gets farther, harder, and they fire faster. Um, but also you have the, um, you know, you've got to stop them from um, laying the mines below you. I believe if you make it all the way around it removes one or something like that as well. I almost made it through and got an extra life. So it was actually quite a good game to get with my system back in the day. Especially since the other one, Armored Assault, was brilliant and I used to play it with my friend but it was only a two player game. So this is the main game that I could play by myself and it was a long time um, before any other decent games came out that I could play. And that's what you know started me along uh, writing my own. Alright. Um, I have done a video on this a very long time ago, but probably haven't covered it in as much detail, so I thought I'd include this in the series of just showing you all the titles that came out for the original Spectre video. I've had some frame rate issues in the past, I believe I have sorted them now, um, and um, so I have recorded some others, I'm going to just throw those away and re-record those, and we'll continue on. Alright, I'm Electric Adventures, thanks to all my subscribers, thanks for watching, and I'll catch you next time. Oh, 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 oh,